to drink it. Sony ZV10, baby. Yeah, I took the wig off. Yeah, how about it? Which, how about it? Who go? Who go? Who go? Who go? Just joking. Uh, I took the wig off. I look crazy. So my hair looks crazy. So we zooming it up. You know what I mean? Look, but this is so good, Nick. Oh my God! Cheers! Yes. So guys, we just having drinks. About to go walking. I need to be outside no later than 8 p.m. Uh, I'm making us some sandwiches now. I got the bread on the oven already. And I've been flipping the bread. What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Mayima. Be your motivation MC, and I'm here to help you get the way you want to be because I'm living my dreams. We are back with another video, you guys, and today is Juneteenth. Shout out to Juneteenth. Shout out to all the slaves who made it able for us to even do this, even able for me to vlog. Like, this wasn't possible years ago to be able to make money on YouTube. None of this was possible for us literally years ago, less than, you know what I mean, not too long ago. So, shout out to all the slaves who dedicated their lives for this moment right here for us to be free. Okay? Drop my dad off. I'm so sad that he left. Like, I'm just like, how can we be Um, but it's all good. You know, he has to go back to work. And, um, I'm actually about to go work out right now. Um, and it's, it's still, it's still kind of early. It's 8.50. It's, yeah, 8.58. 858. Can y'all see that? 858. And I'm about to go work out. I know it's like like damn you really working out this late but yeah i do work out this late as you can see it's still actually light outside um which is why i love this time of the year because it's still light outside and you can work out as late as possible and it's okay you know what i mean like, it's okay so i'm actually about to put on my shoes right now i don't know where my shoes are 
Um, so I'm about to put on my shoes and then we're gonna head out. All right, all right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, and did I forget to mention that we are on the Sony ZV-10? This is the upgraded version, you know what I mean? Bada bing, bada boom. I didn't even do anything to the settings. I just turned it on. So I don't know if I need to do like a better search settings where I like defocus the background or whatever. But I'm going to play with it a lot more. Probably get on YouTube and just look at like all the things that I can do with it. But this is the Sony ZV-10 camera, baby. We finally got our batteries. I had to get on Amazon and order like a charger set a battery set just everything because it the camera doesn't come with that by itself so you need to literally order like everything once you purchase this camera the sony zv10 make sure you get on amazon and get you a rechargeable battery pack just the whole battery pack so i just but uh, just went ahead and did that because i ended up waiting four extra days after i had my camera so y'all know i've been wanting to turn my camera on my baby just been sitting there just waiting for me so i'm super excited that I'm able to vlog now, so let's get into this video, baby. Anyways, you guys, I'm here. It's your girl Naima, and I'm about to do my makeup and talk about a couple of things. So this is actually a mirror that I got from Amazon, and it's really, really great for just having like a makeup a makeup travel mirror like it's great for um traveling like clutch clutch all right just in case like you know it's a couple of girls on a trip and everybody can't get in the mirror you know what i mean everybody not gonna I can't even believe I'm finished this primer already by Milk, but I honestly feel like I never even really got great wears out of it. I'm just being honest. Like I, I still don't even know if it like really, really works because I just don't know. Anyways, you guys, y'all not gonna believe this. Like, I'm not really sure what is wrong with me, but I just literally be sweating in this place. Like. The way I be sweating, it be so embarrassing. Like, the way I sweat literally makes me... Okay, I'm so upset that barely anything is coming out. And honestly, I think I only use this, like, two, two three times the most. So, anyways, that sucks. Let's continue to move on to the makeup. Honestly, you guys, I'm not going to do too much makeup just because... I feel like I got one of those faces that you don't even really got to do too much. You don't got to do too much because, baby, it's going to give regardless. It, it, it's still going to give. So, let's get straight to it. We're going to go ahead and get started with the MAC um, by Stud um, liner. When I tell you guys this liner. Oh, wait. Before I do that, I kind of want to do... The eyebrow thing that everybody's doing like you just kind of just smooth your eyebrows out like so just a little bit first mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they were really taking the the lash glue and doing it but anyways this is kind of dried up so let's keep on moving so let's go ahead and take our stud by mac liner and get into these brows honey so my sister came this week my dad came this week and you know it was father's day this weekend and we just when i tell you me and my family had a time me and my family i said i was gonna put my watch on let's see how many miles have i done today you guys already i feel really good really amazing um i've done uh, come on uh, are you serious are you really not gonna show oh 3.94 miles about eighty-two thousand steps and a day's like not even done and i think i may work out tonight so let's go ahead and take this off because 
I know the girlies be wearing it when they do their makeup, but I like to take it off because I just like to really make sure that I'm also really, really getting into my lace. So, they go to lace looking butters. <laughs> looking butters or whatever. So, let's just go ahead and... Hold on, All right, so let's get to this. Let's get to this face. All right. First and foremost, we're gonna start with our brows and slightly brush in a side motion. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then we're gonna go to the next brow. Start at the bottom. I don't know if you guys could tell, but I actually like to naturally bring my brows a little bit closer in because I feel like it it what that does is it makes your nose look a little smaller. Whenever you bring your brows in and make your brows go in more, it just takes the attention off of your nose. And yeah, that's that. Now I like to take my concealer of choice and the concealer of choice that I'm using Right now is going to be the Tarte um, Deep Sand. So you guys, I watched the whole Kamora Lee Simmons thing and Ooh, child. Honey, she is hurt. She felt like she was too young to get married. She felt like it came out that he pretty much was with her while she was a sophomore in high school. She says she went to her junior and senior year with her girlfriends because she was with him at the time, y'all. Like, what? Kamora Lee Simmons, are you serious? Like, how was that swept under the rug? How was that okay? How did we as a community not say anything? And I, I'm, I'm, what I'm guessing is, is because she was kind of like, you know, different. She was like, a foreign chick, you know what I mean? Like, she was kind of foreign, and I feel like that's why he got away with it. I, I'm just being honest. I feel like that's one of the biggest reasons why he really got away with being with her like that. But I mean, that was really before like social media really, really kicked. So people weren't able to leave comments. You know what I mean? Like we literally at that time just saw it on television and people really kind of kept their comments to themselves or, you know, amongst their family members. It was never like, ooh, girl, let's go to the comments and see about this relationship. You know what I mean? So, at that time, I guess it wasn't really a bad thing. You know, even with all the stuff that R. Kelly was doing, a lot of stuff was swept under the rug. Well, anyways, child. Kamora Lee really started saying all kind of things like he pretty much is hiding out in wherever. They say he's in Bali. And he... 
doesn't have any money since he's had a couple of like sexual assault allegations under his name it kind of just really messed up his business and just everything like that honestly i had no idea that he had sexual assault charges against him like i had no idea about that you know what i mean like it'd be so crazy how much stuff you don't even know is going on that's really going on so anyways you guys i'm use i'm still using the tart cosmetics this tart is just just this my color deep sand is my color um anyways you guys So he flees the country and he's been giving his daughters maybe like $500 a month salary and 500, maybe a little bit more than that, $700 a month. And all of a sudden, Russell, Sim Russell Simmons cuts them off. Like he doesn't tell them why he's cutting them off. He doesn't do any of those things. He just literally like cuts them off, stop, stops the music, stops the money flow from coming in and the girls are livid the girls are just like how could he now all the expenses and everything everything just falls on Kimora so pretty much Kimora has to try to double up giving like double up spending just because that money isn't there anymore and obviously they needed the money because if they did not need the money, baby, they would not have got online and aired their father out. So the daughter, I don't know if it was the oldest or the youngest, but I believe it was the oldest daughter. The oldest daughter gets online, y'all. She's in her bed. Ah, ah, ah. And I didn't see all of it. I just saw like a clip and this girl was like, he doesn't do this. He doesn't do that. Like, honey, going in about her father. And I'm just like, ooh, girl. Oh, wait, hold on. I do want to blend it in. And I'm over here like, ooh, girl, you is calling your daddy all the way out so then of course everybody the whole public is just like look at these little brats they of age the money cut off and now they're upset how dare these little girls just get online and air their dad out their dad took care of them their whole life these are spoiled little rich kids look at these spoiled little rich kids so then kamora gets online and kamora is just like look let me tell you what it really is and it be so crazy because these women always be feeling like they got to get online and air these men out. And it be so crazy because what you thought was one thing is really not. And it always be like that. It always be like that. That's why I just be like, don't believe. When I be seeing all of that stuff on Instagram of date night with hubby and we doing this tonight and all of this stuff girl please that man you just don't even know you be surprised you be surprised a lot of men get married for, because the wife is their cover-up their wife is a cover-up to let to try to hide this real sexuality a lot of times okay a lot of times that they ask you will you marry me because they really are on the down low and um they need that cover up eh you 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 that cover up ma'am so why you just thinking you high and mighty because you got a man baby it's never been that <laughs> okay so i mean keep keep the high and mighty because it's never been that it's never been that even when you thought it was it has never been that um 
This is how I do my I love it. I love it so much. This this is probably my favorite part of the makeup is doing this part by my nose. Like this is my this is probably my favorite part of makeup. So, anyways, you guys, she gets online and really starts crying, talking about I was way too married. First of all, she was like, first of all, let's start off. I was too young to get married. Okay, I've been a mother my whole life. I've been a mother since I've been a mother before, I, like since I was a little girl. I was, you know, she pretty much really was saying she was groomed, you know, until until into the person who she is and you know she said we, we don't really we don't really see what's really going on you know what I mean and honestly speaking you guys that's just is that's just crazy that's just crazy that Kamara Lee all of this is going on and you know he's somewhere hiding in like the middle of nowhere nobody knows where he is so Anyways, you guys, yeah. Now I'm gonna take my espresso and just bring me the laces. I'm gonna put some espresso. Put some cup espresso all right here on my lace too and around in here yep give it a little darkness and then what i now what i like to do is blend that espresso in so this is what it looks like as i'm blending it in espresso is like everything now I'm gonna take my I hate that I got this I wish I would have got it a little bit a smidge darker but it's okay this isn't bad but it could I went back to get a darker one and then I'm also realizing that I could have I could have got an even darker one so I'm just gonna apply See, it could be a little darker. It's still a little light. So anyway, how next was going on? Um, did y'all see Corey and what's her name? I forgot her name. Corey and Carmen. I watched the whole thing on my way, dropping my dad home. I watched the whole just video of them getting together. It be so crazy how a man be so upset that you just text somebody else and all she did was text i know from what they were saying honey i don't know but all she did apparently is text somebody else and he did not take that very well at all he took it as a complete insult Like, how dare you? Like, how dare you insult me? How dare you, woman? Like, the nerve. The nerve of you that just insults me like that. You know what I mean? Like... That's, that's really what that was. 
Um, anyways, what am I talking about? So I was watching Corey and um and that was kind of crazy to me because they got on live or whatever. They had they came to a whole damn studio. Uh who was left with the bill? Like, did y'all pay the girl? You know what I'm saying? Like Y'all rented out a whole studio to say that y'all broke up. It just began on my nerves how these men will put a baby in you and be quick to run away. Like, quick to run away, good. You be like... You know what I mean? Like, I feel sister's pain. I, I feel her pain. She better have a time of her life with these niggas. I'm just really being honest because uh, you. Mm. But anyways, that was crazy. This makeup is looking good. I'm gonna add a little bit. What kind of lip store one is? <laughs> I'm kind of really just gonna leave my hair like as is. I'm not gonna do much to it. But I guess what kind of lip I wanna do? What kind of lip I wanna do? I look pretty. I guess I could do. Um, dimension. I love this stuff. This dimension stuff. I don't want to automatically put heat on. I want to put something else over it. I don't know what. Let me see. Pink It's pretty. How do I look, guys? Cute little basic. Cute little basic. Basic, basic, basic. Okay, I'm going to fix my hand. And uh, I probably want to do a wing.
I feel pretty. I feel pretty. <laughs> okay, you guys. My makeup is done. Now it's time to get dressed. Makeup done, hands done. Mm -hmm. Let's go wash my hands mm -hmm. and get out of here. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, but okay. Yeah, let's let's get up out of here. That's had a good job. Why is that a good job? Well, I do gotta go grocery shopping, so I guess we could go grocery shopping. Oh, I do want to put a little bit of. I do want to bake my face a little bit. Just get them Laura, Laura Marcy in. You guys, when I went out the other night, I honestly did not have time to do this stuff. I love, shout out to the Sony ZV-10. It's the battery for me. Like, this battery thing has been on for a minute and my whole makeup is done and I didn't even have to get another battery yet. The battery life on this camera is like absolutely everything like it's so worth it the sony zv10 is better 100 percent better than the sony zv1 baby i love it it's such a good camera it's such a good camera yeah so what else is going on in the news i feel like there's so much stuff going on oh let me spray I didn't even spray this stuff, but I could do it. And I'm just gonna spray my Too Faced. Too Faced. My nails look so crazy. Oh, let me tell you guys a story. So, one time, y'all, I went on a date. And tell me if this is wrong or not. Would you talk to a guy again if. Asked you to go Dutch on a bill. Like, the bill comes, you really think he's gonna pay. Like, obviously, this is the first date. Obviously, this guy's acting like he like you. You know what I mean? So, imagine when a bill comes and he's like, I got my tab. I got my tab. Like, that's what he says to let you know he got his tab. Like, do you still talk to that person or do you say, I'm moving on. For me, it's more so I'm moving on. I can't talk to you if you didn't even put in the clear that we were going Dutch. You should have said that in the beginning of the thing that you wanted to go Dutch. Like, I just kind of feel that way. So, for me, it's a no. It's, it's definitely a no. We're not going out again. Sorry. But what are some of y'all thoughts on that? Because I've really had that happen to me. Like, I really just thought that was, like, extremely crazy. I couldn't believe it happened to me. Like, I was really, like, looking around, like... I was really looking around, like... Is this really happening? But anyways, you guys, it is back wedding season. I've been doing a lot of wedding consultations. I'm so excited. It's, it's one of the ladies who I'm doing, she was a bridesmaid. And she literally said, she was just like, when I get married, if I ever get married, she said, I want Naima Bennett to do my hair and my makeup. And literally, y'all, it's been, it's definitely been over 10 years since, it's been a very long time since um, she was a bridesmaid in um, someone's specific wedding. And I did her hair and makeup. She was like, you want to do my makeup? So I'm so happy um, to be doing her hair and her makeup for her wedding. And it's just a beautiful thing. Um, 
Yeah, it's just beautiful. Um, what else is going on? I don't know, but I'm gonna try this one again. I'll be back. Well, because that's how you're gonna get the cleanest image out of your camera as much as possible. The higher that ISO yes. number is, the more grain will be introduced into your video footage. Okay. So I just want to encourage you to use a good light and make sure your ISO is as low as it can be while making sure your exposure is at. What's up, you guys? I had to cut my nails down. I actually really yes. You used to pop up. You have to use the you have to peep. You have to use the um. You have to poo poo. Here, poo poo in here. Sit down and poo poo. Sit down and poo poo. If you have to pee pee, use that one. Aim and shoot over there. Aim and shoot. Good job. Aim and shoot. Good job. Yeah, you guys. Um, Woohoo! He's doing so good. We're just learning the party. I can't even believe. This is where we're here now. Uh, somebody asked you to leave. All right, Harlem, enough with the party. Enough with the party. Bedtime. And make sure you poo poo. Make sure you poo poo in the party. Poo poo in the party. You got a poo poo? No. Okay, poo poo if you have to. No? Alright, you done? Yeah. You no more? You going you you getting back in the bathtub? No. No? Alright. Bedtime? Yeah. Alright, good night, Papa. Night. Night night, love you. Yeah, yeah. You come calling in my bed every single night, you guys. So, <laughs> so my bed is in <laughs> Give me a kiss. Mm. Love you. Yeah. <laughs> you. Love you too, Papa. Okay. You get under the covers? No. What you want? Oh my gosh, Papa. You okay? Yeah. Here, here's a pillow. <laughs> Look at your pillow. Oh, oh, watch out. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. What? Mm-hmm. Get your own pillow? Yeah. Okay. Now listen to this. You, you're you not going to pee, 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 pee in the bed, are you? No? Are you going to go to the bathroom? If you got to if you gotta use the potty? Yeah, you're going to go to the bathroom. If you got to use the potty, okay? Yes. Good job. <laughs> yes. Silly. <laughs> so, anyways, um, but anyways, today was good, guys. I just, I'm, I'm so happy. Like, it's crazy. My family came in town, and I know this vlog is probably like really all over the place. Just being honest, cause honestly, just I'm just now getting the camera, so. Um, um, newly, um, yeah, there's still so many settings that I really, uh, there's so many settings that I really, I just can't wait to use or whatever on this phone. Oh, wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Oh, because yeah, it's so intelligent, so I can't. Okay. Okay. So yes, you yeah. guys. Um, excuse me, stop mocking me. <laughs> excuse me, stop mocking me. Thank you. Yes, so, you. Thank you. So there are so many. Like I was what? saying, there's so many settings on <clears throat> this camera that I cannot honestly wait to use and just everything like that like so far oh let me push this back so far you guys ooh. so far i am very happy oh listen if anybody has a sony zv1 nine times out of ten you guys i am not why is he He's just gonna find anything, y'all. 
But like I was saying, nine times out of ten. And that could be copyright and free music. So he's playing in the background. Yeah, keep going. Hey. So nine times out of ten. Um I am let's turn it down a little bit. It's good music. I like it. It's good. At zero or plus oh wait, three. no, wait. Kind of something like that. The next thing we're gonna... That was good, whatever you had on. Uh Jeez. Um, that's not a. That's not like a. Lay down. Go to bed. Bedtime. Go. Is is this is my time. This is my time to vlog, and and do a recap with with the with the game. Like it's like it's me and the game time. So. But anyways, guys, like I was saying, this weekend was when I tell y'all like absolutely amazing. So, first of all, I was like really stressed out early in the week, um, and then my sister was, was just kept reminding me. She was like, "I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming towards the end of the weekend," I'm, and I just was like, "Okay, that's gonna be like so good, just to, you know, just take my mind off of just everything." And my sister ended up coming, which was so nice. And Harlem was so happy to see her. And then, guess what, guys? To top it all off, my daddy came. Daddy was in the building. And when I tell y'all, we enjoyed each other so much. I ended up going out with my sister. Y'all, I did not want to go. I am literally the type of person that I'm just like, I don't want to go. I don't want to go to the club. I don't want to do anything. I don't want to. Uh, uh, I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I just started getting like, oh my god, like what's gonna happen? I just started start be thinking and just like all kind of stuff or whatever, y'all. I'm not telling no lie. When I tell you, I was so happy. Like, I, when I say happy, like. I couldn't believe like how happy I was to go like I'm so happy I went and I literally like the whole time I was telling myself like you just need to start going out like because when you finally get here you're going to be happy that you got here you're going to be happy that you came you're going to be happy that you experienced it like you know what I mean it's just that devil like on the way you know what i mean so honestly speaking guys it just reminded me like going out this weekend reminded made me feel like like back in the days when i was in high school trying to go out like yeah. but no i just grown yes Yeah, but it's time to go to bed. So lay down. Come on over here. Come here. Lay down. Come here. Lay down. Touch me. Are you touching me? Yes. Okay. He always be yeah. By the end of the night, he's gonna be cuddled under me. Okay. He's gonna he's gonna make sure he's touching me. So I was like, come closer. Come touch me. And like, he ain't even touching me. If you ask for it, you ain't gonna get it. So. But anyways, you guys, um, I am really happy. I'm so happy my family came. So everybody's going now. My sister, um, she went back Friday, wait, Sunday. Sunday, and my dad went back today. So they're both gone. Today was Juneteenth, so... Um, today was Juneteenth, so, you know, all schools was out and just everything. So, we just were home relaxing. I didn't even film. I'm so sad. I didn't film any of the foods that we cooked. We made that made spaghetti. Um, we had, like, bacon, burgers. We grilled. <laughs> I didn't even film us growing. My sister might actually have some 
footage so i'm gonna see like what kind of footage she got and hopefully i can put it all in this vlog for you guys um but i just want to let you guys know like right now i'm almost at 400 subscribers you know shout out to the gang i'm almost at 400 subscribers i can't even believe like it's crazy that i'm almost at 400 subscribers So I'm just excited and I really am just all about right now just being consistent, just being consistent with where I am, where I'm going, the direction I'm going in and just everything. Like I'm so excited. So thank you guys for everything. Thank you all 300 and X, Y, Z of y'all like for being my supporters and for, you know, <laughs> Be here on this journey with me. I love you, Fat. I love y'all. Straight up. All right, you guys. I'm about to go to bed. I promise you guys. And I will see you guys in the next vloggy vlog. Good night. Good night.